somebody call a doctor because bad medicine is back. I am here once again to continue on my Hogwarts legacy journey with part six. We are on and I am having an absolute blast. Thank you guys again so much for joining me today. Um, quick wrap up of part five and some of the advice and tips that you guys gave me. I learned that I don't have to be at a fireplace to use flu powder to travel. So that is a huge hint. Also learned that when I get new gear in my upper right hand corner, I'm going to be made aware whether I am leveling up or down as far as my offense or defense. I was also reminded that the color around an enemy is the color that I have to use to attack them. Purple for Accio, red for Incendio, <clears throat> yellow for Levioso. Levioso, <laughs> I'm always gonna get that one. Um, some, some mixed kind of feedback as far as Revelio spamming. I'm just gonna try to keep it a friendly balance. I know some people were like, hey, less, you know, less Revelio, less side quests, get on with the gameplay. But I do wanna kinda, as I've said before, have a happy balance between kind of exploring things. Somebody did mention, um, which I hadn't even thought of, that there are lots of areas to explore outside of Hogwarts, outside of Hogsmeade and just the grounds. So definitely something I am going to keep in mind. And the last thing I'm gonna say is I did look for a little bit of help as far as the doors. And basically it's just a math equation. Starting with one on my left, going all the way around. And you have to complete, complete rather the equation. So significantly less complicated than I thought it was gonna be. And if I'm being perfectly honest, oh, I'm a little embarrassed that I didn't figure that out on my own or at least try it, but I thought it was gonna be some sort of code. In fact, maybe it was just a matter of being overly simplistic that I hadn't thought about. So in any regard, we are going to get going. I'm gonna get my headphones on and get another journey started. Okay. I wonder how big this place is. All right, so as I just left off, I had defeated a couple of uh, couple of goblins. Ooh, what is this now? Pork lump juice. We're gonna collect plenty of that. Oh, another big tip that I was given was to. Um, To go back to the um, <clears throat> back to the potions room. These rooms must have something to do. Somebody with did mention door. before the last episode Moonstone. Oh wow! Okay, uh, that's a massive cliff. We are not going to jump off of that. What are these? I can shoot the symbol, but it doesn't stay lit for long. to light all three before they time out on me. See, this is the one thing that I, I had mentioned, somebody else mentioned. Okay, what is this? Oh, I got all three in time. So this bridge... <clears throat> Excuse me. Casual visitors down there, or not? Oh, okay. So this door opened up for me. Oh, uh, oh, there's enemies. Okay. So here's a question: Should I be fighting these guys when I see them in red on my screen? Because what's this over here? Did I just collect some coins. Nice, eleven coins. I wonder if any of my spells are coming through this. Haha. <laughs> I learned that you can burn through spider webs with incendio. Oh, okay. Incendio. Okay. Stupid. Stupid. Oh. Stupid. 
Incendio. I need to be using Incendio a lot more. Oh, shit. Oh, excuse me. Language. But not really. Incendio. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, shit. So one thing that somebody else did say... Okay, complete dueling feats. So I do need to be fighting these things. Um, one thing that somebody else did say is that um, I need to work on um, Spider Fang. That I need to work on my, um, my dueling and that I have to work on spell combinations. And that basically the only time I should be using just my generic spell. Okay, am I gonna have to fight these things? Okay. Thornback shooter. I guess that's a yes. Okay. Um, that I need to be using more spell combinations. Take that. Incendio. Stupid. Alright. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, I got one behind me. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, there's a lot of these guys. Oh, there's a lot of them. Oh, Jesus. Incendio. Shit, 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 RB, RB. Uh, RB, why is the RB not working? Oh, shit. Too far away. I need to do. I need to get better at these. I need to get better at those. God. Oh, I just need to get better at the. I think Accio. I think Accio and. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Accio and Incendio is where it's really at, right? Like bring them in, then torch them. I think that's definitely where it's at. You guys see me get a little, little worked up. I wasn't expected to get completely surrounded by those things. <clears throat> okay, so what am I going to do with all these spider things? Rebellion. Oh, okay. Um, another thing that I learned is when there is an eye on the chest, I have to go hidden. Spring Ivy Scarf. Okay, so now I do see an up arrow. Okay, cool, cool. Thank you very much for that. So I am going to go to my gear and check out my neckwear. And this is my Spring Ivy Scarf. Whoa. That is a big jump in offense. We are going to equip... Um, I'm going to back out. I don't like the appearance, so I am going to go with no appearance because I like my collar popped like that. But thank you to, um, <clears throat> those of you who said to check out the, um, check out the upper right hand corner. Okay. Defeat goblins. Okay. So I got to defeat them. Okay, defeat spiders. Defeat mongrels. Oh, so these are all challenges. Okay. Defeat 10 spiders. I get spider slayer armor and spider slayer helmet. Um, what do I get for, what do I get for defeating the mongrels? 
Oh, I gotta defeat ten of them. Complete dueling feats. Officer's uniform. Okay, four out of five. Defeat goblins. Three out of thirty? One out of five? Okay. Defeat twenty dark... Okay, so... Slow down here, okay? Got a long way to... Long way to go. Um, I'm gonna check out my cloak, though, because I want to see what this thing looks like. Um. Okay. That is badass. But I like my crocodile Dundee look. Okay. And we are going with that. Headwear? Did I get... <laughs> Okay, headwear, we're going to check out appearance. Did I get an appearance package helmet, or was that for another upgrade? So, <clears throat> when I was younger, I played Dungeons & Dragons with my brothers. So, there's a little bit of, like, young Oak getting super pumped about this this armor right now. My bro In fact, my older brother... My older brothers and the neighbor kids that we played with back when we were in grade school, um, they still get together on Sunday nights and do online Dungeons and Dragons with like a group of 10 guys. A little bit hard for me to um, meet up with them and do that just because of my schedule. But oh my God, guys, look at this. Does it slow me down at all or anything? What? I just got a suit of fucking armor. Are you kidding? Holy shit. What? Incendio. Doesn't really help to just burn random spider webs. Okay. Kind of went in the wrong direction to go fight those spiders, I guess, huh? Look at that. I can still sprint in this thing. Revelio. Revelio. That chest gave me some pretty cool stuff. Okay. Wait a minute. Did I just... Oh, man. I gotta run all the way back around. Are you kidding me? I was just over there. Nope, not going down that way. I turned around and ran the wrong way. Look, I got so excited duking it out with those spiders. Okay. Oh, what is that? That platform ought to be able to float straight to me. I mean... Whoa, okay. All right. Looks like I got more of these dudes on my hands. Oh, smoking with some ancient magic. All right, we are going to Accio and Incendio. Holy shit. Are you kidding me? I did one Accio and Incendio and smoked that thing? Is that really all it takes, guys? Guys, is that really all it takes to beat the spiders? Is one Accio and Incendio? Am I supposed to be shooting this? One Accio and Incendio? An untouched chest. Tactile wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. He certainly wasn't. I just got 64 coins. Wait a minute. Didn't I just go around the side there? No, I was just here. And that's where I fought the spiders. Okay. Getting a little turned around here because I'm a little excited. Back here. Oh! <laughs> This one brought me over there. Alright, there we go. Whoa. 
Revelio. Coins. There's some cool looking stuff here. Teal striped attire. Okay, um, so uh, again, um, definitely a, uh, a level up for me. Oh, what are those? What is that? <clears throat> oh, and a chest. Where was that chest? Must be around the other side. Okay, I got turned around again. Wait a minute. Revelio. Do I gotta go back around? Am I in another dead end? Are you kidding me? Or is there something under me? Hmm. What is going on here? Alright, we are gonna go that way, but I am gonna quick take a look at my gear. Because... What's my inventory? What do I got here? Spider fangs. Oh, okay. So, I can use it in potion. Cool, cool. Alright, let's check my gear. What is new? Outfit. Okay. Striped attire. Wow. Big. Up with my defense. Cell value destroy. Why is that locked? Oh. Oh. I got it, but apparently I can't use it. All right. It is what it is. All right, I'm just going to jump down here. There is a lot to explore in this cave. Oh. Oh, here we go. Akio, incendio. Potato, stupid. Oh, stupid. Akio, incendio. Oh, there's one behind me. Stupid. Incendio. There's a victory that came none too soon. Ugh. Oh. Another puzzle. Well, if Jackdaw could solve this, so can I. Oh, there's three of them. I see. Oh, what do we got now? Guys, this is so cool. This is some of the most fun I've had exploring yet. That's the door I just came through. Okay. Revelio. I thought there was a chest over here. So. Okay, that's over there. Spiders. Just gotta get through here and turn around real quick. Oh, they're waiting to attack me. Look at this. Oh, 
Oh, those spiders I don't even need to go into full battle with, or what? Do I need to be killing those spiders? Okay, that was nasty. Rebellion. I thought there was a chest over here. What is that? See, I wanted to go toe to toe with these fools. Up my levels. How do I battle these guys? Accio. Should I try Accio then? I guess I don't need to pick a fight where it's not needed. Wait, what is that? What was that right there? It looked like a cauldron came up underneath. Alright, we're just gonna keep going. Which way did I need to go now? I turned around. Guys, I keep getting turned around in here. I keep getting turned around going after these spiders and whatnot. Okay. How do I get over there? Which way do I have to go? Because I was just over here. Right? Okay, so I was over here. And then this door opened, so I went through this way. And there's nothing this way. So I went through this way and only found spiders, so I gotta go around this way. No, this way was only... God. What's going on here? It's Frustrated here because I don't know what was, what was that. I don't know where to go. And I don't know how to fight those spiders. I feel like I should have to go right here, but I can't. And it's telling me to go elsewhere. for the missing pages either. Okay, just gotta run around more. Oh, what's this? I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Wiggle well potion. So to help me heal. Track, right? Right? Right, guys? <laughs> right, guys? Now I'm on the right track? No! Oh. Just get turned around again? Yes. Shit. Okay, more Okay, can't go that way. Already went this way. That's the way I went last time. Revelio. Incendio. I don't know what that does, but it sure does look cool. Lumos. I don't know. Okay. Incendio. Alright, 
so now I'm in new territory. Alright. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. Akio! from behind or what? Oh, what just happened? They put me in slow motion. Whew. That got a little intense, huh? Spider fangs over here. Ooh, another chest. That's so odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Competitive school robe. Okay, so that's got the down arrow, so sweet. Now I know what's what. God, there's so much to explore in this game. Let's see, it looks like there's a chest up over there. There is just so much to explore in this cave. Drop it a comment below if you also got really turned around in this cave, like trying to explore everything there is to see. But also... Rebellion. Okay, now I'm just going in the wrong direction, but I want to know where those chests are. Is that even a chest, or is that more of those things? Well, that's definitely a chest. An untouched chest? Embroidered Jackal wasn't very in thorough form. in his search of this cave. I'll see if I can even put this thing on. Outfit. Oh, wow. Okay, this is still locked. But I'll equip that. Sweet. Cloaks and robes. This one was downgraded. Yep, we don't want to wear that one. Okay. Right. <clears throat> Rebellion. Okay. Let's continue on. And now I am completely turned around again. How do I get that chest? Can I get a chest? Apparently not. 
Alright, how do I get that chest over there? Or did I get that one already? I think I got that already. What was that? Oh, those are the candles floating. Okay. Now I am going to try to make my way back around. And once again, I am completely and utterly turned around. Oh my god, with these caves. Oh, oh god. Y'all don't care if I swear, do you? Nobody really cares if the oak drops a few F-bombs, do they? I don't think so. Like, holy hell. Rebellion. Oh, there's the chest up over there. I knew my perseverance would pay off. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me. Four but five where coins. could he be? Okay. Wait a minute. Incendio. Am I about to have like oh, what's this? What what's going on with that question mark? Are these things gonna come at me or I gotta defeat them through this hole in the wall? Keep an enemy airborne. Akio! Let me also. Well, I can't very well. I can't very well fight him if they're on the other side. How do I crawl? Is there a way to crawl? Duck. I don't see any way to duck. I guess I'm not battling those guys. Um. Holy Jesus. Okay, you know what? I'm just starting to pay attention that there's an entire cave system on the map. Did I already open this one? I think I did, yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay, I feel like I keep getting further and further away from this stuff, guys. I'm gonna have a straight aneurysm any minute now. Yeah, see, this is just, this isn't getting me where the fudge I need to go. Oh, what the? I am so turned around, it's not even funny. How many of you are, I don't know if you guys at this point are laughing at me or there yelling. It is. The bridge, it's almost complete. Holy shit, I mean. Revelio. More spiders. Oh shit. Okay. Okay. Incendio. Protego. Oh. Dude. Oh. Oh shit. You got me. Accio. Incendio. You. Shit. Oh, fuck, they're everywhere. Oh, I need to levitate. Oh, I 
was it? Eight legs is simply too many. Oh, what's this now? What's going on? What's going on? Oh shit. Another one behind me. Oh shit. Oh, you bastard. Oh shit. Rebellion. Okay, that was a lot. Wasn't ready to fight that many. But I made it out. Had to use way too much of my hork lump juice. Not excited about that. One bit. Not even a little. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm. But I may as well help myself to this. I need to look around for the symbol. Incendio! Lumos! I didn't mean to use that. Alright, I guess I'm running around a little bit more. Incendio! Akio! Hidden somewhere. Rebellious. It's hidden somewhere. You don't say. Rebellio. It's under me. See, that's the one thing that I will gripe about a little bit, is that I don't think they give you enough time to work these things out on your own until they tell you, they give you like those cute clues, you know? Perhaps it's hidden somewhere, <laughs> like, okay, it's hidden somewhere, I get it. Okay, it's here, but there's no way that... There's no way to... that I can do all three in time. Unless you jump off the cliff and do that. <laughs> okay. Wow. This has been an adventure, to say the least. Now where is that bridge? I don't even know where it is now. This is how turned around I am down here. I got it together, but where is it? Ah, up here. Rebellion. Look at that. I finally Must made it across you guys. Remains and those pages. Holy Jesus. What is this? We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these years. Here it is. 
The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Wow. Is there something beyond this room? Oh shit. That's why all the horks lump juice. Oh shit. Incendio. Oh, Jesus. I feel like I'm going to be getting my ass whooped. Oh. even works against this guy. Oh Jesus, now two of them at the same time? Great. Oh shit. I got no horse on juice. Heavy also doesn't work. Oh my god. Oh. More? What? Are you kidding me? Some nothing. What's happening? Is there anything I didn't collect here from dude? Wait a minute, what are these swords? Accio. Levioso. Incendio. Accio. Rebellion. <sighs> Thought that was it, guys. I think it's before. In Gringotts and the restricted section. Investigate the mysterious force. Don't mind if I do. Rebellion. Oh my Where god, guys, I? this has been probably the most intense gameplay that I've had so far in all of my all of my playing. Oh no. The room's starting to flood. Oh Jesus. Wear an armor suit. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? Okay, this is definitely weird. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of it. 
We're gonna keep our fingers crossed. What is this place? Revelio. Oh, I'll get my armor and gold, gold, gold. Yeah. Glow gold. Holy shit, this is so cool. See, this is what I'm talking about when it's just, it's more than just a video game. It's like an entire immersive universe. Someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And might I presume you share our ability to see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation oh, until come we return on. with the book. For real. I'll bring the book here. Why is this called the map chamber? And are you a seer? I'll start with the are you a seer. The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside. Those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. I'm a bit confused, sir. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. Uh, we shall speak again once the book is in place. Your connection to ancient magic has been unlocked has unlocked talents plus one. You will receive one talent point each time you increase your wizarding letter. You have new talent points to spend in the talents menu in your field guide. You've earned talent points plus one starting at level five. You may spend these talent points as you wish to enhance your spells to increase your combat power, stealth, and more. Choose wisely. Talent points may only be spent once, so the number of talents you acquire will be limited. Return here often to see what powerful and new talents await you. No, 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 no. Oh, I thought that map meant I bought something. No. That was just an Xbox thing. These talents enhance your use of potions and combat plants, ability to sneak around, overall effectiveness, abilities with the dark arts. These talents help improve your spell casting. Overall effectiveness. Level five, acquired talent. A new spell set is added. Oh, so you have another spell set. Whoa! Oh, that's cool. 
Successful Plurtego blocks will contribute to the ancient magic meter. Basic cast, impact, reduce spell cooldowns. Oh gosh, guys, this feels like a lot of pressure. Oh my god, dark arts. Stunning curse stupefies the same effect as a curse on enemies. Cursed enemies take increased damage. Blood curse. Oh, wow. Okay, that was a core that I already looked at. Dark Arts spells. Casting Incendio releases a ring of flame around you? Enemies near a target? Oh. Enemies. Oh my god, guys, what? How do I pick? Oh no! Oh, the chomping cabbages. I didn't even use those yet. I gotta try using those. Makes you invulnerable and deflects projectile attacks. Oh my god, guys. I don't even know what to use. Um. I feel like... I feel like it's gotta be this one. I'm gonna go with that. I'm going with Incendio. It's the one I went with, guys. That's the one I went with. <sighs> Find the exit. Rebellion. This has been like so intense, this particular like gameplay. Seriously. Wow. So now I gotta get back to the cave. <sighs> I think I need like a break. <laughs> oh my god. I found the pages and the map chamber. Why would I need the book? Equipping with better gear. Why did it just give me a reminder of that? Inventory, I don't need to keep checking. Cloaks and robes. Did I get something better? What is this? Take this to the room of requirement? What? Okay. I'm gonna exit the ch exit the chamber. Oh, you see that? Okay. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. All right. Now that the map chamber is in my flu flames, I can use that. I was gonna use that flu flames, but honestly, I just want to. I want to see what's what's out here. This is wild. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder what I was thinking. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Dapper Moth Ensemble. That is a downgrade. 
new quest available. Hell yeah. You need to learn to pulso, the banishing charm. Useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. Okay, but I feel like there's a lot of tasks. I gotta get the book. I gotta get... What gear did I... Am I not aware of? Oh yeah, this thing right here. We don't need that. Okay. Talents? Wait a minute. Nine talent points available? Wait, what? Have I just not been paying attention at all? Like, even a little? Enemies near... Do I want that? Dark Arts? Blood Curse? I don't think I've done Blood Curse yet, have I? Core? Basic cast impacts reduces. Yeah, I want that. I don't know that that's... A new spell set is added. Nah, I don't really want that one. Wiganwald has a greater effect. Ancient magic throw catches um, still room of requirement. Okay, I think for right now, um, spells. So if I Accio, it gives a bunch of people. You know what? I think I'm going to save some talent points because I know it said you can only use so many. Alright, I'm just going to go through and check this stuff, guys. Just because. Ancient pages. Okay. <clears throat> Talents. Okay, I know I have talent points available. We don't need to keep checking that. Collections. Uh, I probably don't need to keep checking this. Yep, 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 yep. I said this before, but I hate having these exclamation points on my, on my, um, I hate having exclamation points. It's like unread emails. You know, people are like, the unread email people either got the thousand unread or zero unread. I'm like the zero unread. Overall progress, combat. Um, oh, yes. My helmet. Huh. You guys. You guys. I don't know if I want to put the helmet on, though, because then I my uh i like the look of my f my face i really do no i don't want that <laughs> it's pretty cool though right i don't uh i don't want anything on i guess but then okay so now does my armor look goofy that I'm running around in full armor without... This is tough. My dark arts robe is so cool. My dragon scale robe. And an outfit. Outfit, we're gonna do change appearance. I 
think I liked this one, didn't I? Or is that cooler? That's more like vampire style. Look at that. All casual. Um, I think I'm going to go with this guy. Or do I want that one? Oh, look at that. Yeah, we're going to go back with this one. Okay, I'm good for a little bit, guys. Okay. Now we need to check out quests. What do we have open? Um, yeah, the keys. Um, Professor Sharp's assignment. Excuse me? Ex Did y'all... Y'all see this one? Flying class? <laughs> uh, I'll do Professor Sharp's assignment first. And then we are going to go to flying class. O-M-G. All right. Acquire and use a focus potion. Talent for spendings or Xbox points. Okay, wait a minute. Why is my quest not tracking? Professor Sharp wants me to test myself while under the influence of both Maxima and Endurance potions. He'd also like me to field test a focus potion. I know how to find potions recipes at J. Pippin's potions. My field guide will not guide me through this assignment. Acquire and use a focus potion. Acquire Maxima and... Uh, okay. Oh, what did I just do? Oh, no. God dang it. Did I really just drink that potion? I did, didn't I? Okay. I can't believe that just happened. Um. I. Chinese recipe. Ashwang's Mongo fur. Okay. Acquire and use a focus potion. Acquire Maxima and use them simultaneously. Okay. I gotta read this quest again, guys. Okay. Professor Sharp wants me to test my Maximus. Field test the focus potion. Okay, so I guess we're going to Jay Pippins. Okay, so somebody did say, actually many of you said that I could go anywhere there is um, <clears throat> Jay Pippins said that I don't need to be next to a flu powder to travel to one. So we'll see if y'all are right. I think you are. Okay. Look at that. And I will go to J. Pippins and set a waypoint. Is literally right here. Okay. We have a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look at it. There's something around the other side. Where's there it is. Rebellion. 
Oh, okay. What can I do for you today? Oh, shit. Seriously? Oh, wow. What? 1200 for the focus potion recipe? Shit. I suppose I can sell these anywhere. Huh? Very good. Never hurts to keep my stocks replenished. Furlined cap. My defense goes up 26 with my furlined cap. Are you kidding? Yeah, this is. I hope to see you again. Farewell for yeah. now. Okay, let me just check something. Okay. I hope to see you again. Farewell. Okay, come on. Do I gotta pay for the f field test of focus potion? I know how to find potions and recipes. Are you kidding me? Acquire and use a focus potion? I gotta spend that much money? Can I just buy it? What can I do for you today? Potion recipes. Combat tools. Okay, well... The recipe is 1200 or the potion itself is 500 Well, I might as well get the recipe. That doesn't make sense to... A wise decision. Thank you. And now what else do I need? Oh, I got 382 bucks. Congratulations. Holy shit. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Son of a bitch. What are the other ones? Maxima and Endurance potions. Holy balls. Endurance potion. Focus potion. Okay. Wait a minute. Maxima and Endurance. Invisibility. Thunderbrew. Mandrake. Okay. So, let's see how much this what dude wants for, for Maxima potion. 500? Alright. There's got to be some stuff for me to sell. You know, I gotta first I gotta put that on. I hope to see you again. How do I not have my silly hat on already? How many people are punching the uh how many punch in the sky because I didn't have my silly hat on that gives me the Oh, it's only up two. Alright, well, you know what? We're gonna equip it. I'll take all the help I can get. And then I will do, um, for headwear, I will do my gear appearance X, but I have it on. Face wear. Okay. All right. Now let's see what we can do here. What can I do for you today? So, oh, 90? Come on. Unidentified room of requirement to reveal its qualities. Okay, so now I got to go to the room I of requirement because I don't have enough well money to buy this. Everybody's saying don't, don't, 
don't forget to skip up the coins or don't forget to charge people. Oh, now I gotta leave. Oh my god, seriously? This game's getting like challenging quests. Okay, Professor Sharp, acquire and use a focus potion. Okay, so I can use a focus potion. That's pretty easy. <clears throat> I'm gonna bail here for a minute, and then I gotta go get what was it, 500 for what that maximum for potion you, recipe? Or wait, can I just buy the maximum potion for 300? Or do I spend the recipe for 500? You know what? I'm gonna be responsible. I'm gonna go try to find to 28 more coins well for now. and just get the recipe. Okay, so, uh, you boys got to get back to the Room of Requirement, which, I got to be honest, I don't even know where that is. Um, Hogwarts map, world map. See, this is what everybody was saying to explore. Eastern side, Forbidden Forest. There's a lot out here. That's Hogsmeade, Hogwarts. So here's the path to Hogsmeade. What's this over here? You know what? Um, you know, what? I'm going to go there and check that out because I think maybe I can get some coins here running around searching stuff. I have no idea what's here whatsoever. All I know is that somebody was like, hey, Make sure to explore the grounds. Acquire and use focus potion. Oh, shit. I can't even, oh my God. A dewbog tongue and a flex weed stem. Let me guess, I could buy that stuff from where I was at. Okay, so I just got the recipe, but I don't have the I don't have the shit to make it. Uh, Let's get this over with, shall we? I have you know what? Do. I'm a little this is the first time I've been like a little worked up. I'm a little worked up, so you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna battle this dude. You know what? Incendio. Where is the other one? Akio. Incendio. Oh, did it just kill me? All right. You know what? Now I'm getting... Now I'm fired up. I'm so used to like going through my quests, right? And just like no problem with the quest. Fuck these spiders. All right, you guys are about the real oh, oaks. Man, the are. real oaks coming out real quick, guys. <laughs> you guys are like took me six parts. All right. Incendio. Stupid one. Akio. Akio. Incendio. Stupid one. What the hell is that? Akio. Incendio. Oh, seriously? <laughs> Fuck. I 
shouldn't be this mad. It's a game, right? Accio, Incendio, Potato. Oh, damn. Oh, some of these I forgot. You can't just jump out of the way. Of. This dude is legit. All right. All right. I see you. Fucker. Akio. Incendio. Akio. Incendio. Take that. Okay, I do have to admit this new incendio is pretty, pretty legit. Just trying to run around and find some coins so I can buy some stuff. Where did those enemies go? All right, we'll take on you guys. I don't even know who you are. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that's cool. Revelio. I don't even know what's out here. What's that paw? Oh, what's this now? What is all this? What is all this? What is this? Am I supposed to be shooting at? Puff of skin? Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. Rebellion. What am I supposed to do? Incendio. to do something with these things. Accio. Revelio. Okay, so they're totally Legio. blue, right? What do I do with them? I don't light them it's on fire. What am I supposed to do with these things? Expelliarmus? No. And so I don't know what to do with these things. Oh, well, this is bogus. I'm trying to hurt you. Oh, what's that? What just happened? Oh, no. Did I just hurt a fluffy puff of skin? Oh, my bad. All right, all We're I want to do is... Get some coins and fight some spiders. That's it. Oh, wow, a deer. What's this? that castle mean that's Hogwarts over there? Is that what that means? Oh, 
this is trippy. Oh, look at that. 25 coins. How many did I say I needed? You're gonna regret coming here. Oh, yeah? Who's this now? Got something you need to say? Where you at? I'd rob my own father if there were galleons in it. Not my mother, mind. I think I'm ready for a battle here, yo. Uh oh, oh this there. dude. Shit. Rookwoods don't go down easy. Let me go, Incendio. Oh shit! Dodged an attack. Good. Incendio. 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 No! Expulsion! Oh, shit. Incendio! Expulsion! Incendio! Nice! Told you guys I'm in a bit of a mood. All right, I'm gonna take on whoever else is over here. Wasn't afraid of that, dude. Looks like it's just around the bend. One, one coin. Who do I got up this way? fighting dogs so is it bad that like I don't actually want to fight a dog I know I have to sorry please. oh really why is that a dueling feat to fight it don't call it a mongrel it's a dog oh, I don't you know what I'm not all right I know I need it for potion but I feel guilty it's like a wolf Oh, a suave mob hat. Well, let's take a look. Looks like it's uh Looks like it's up to from What? Why can't I get it? What's the deal with this stuff being locked? I'm gonna have to look more into that. Oh, what was that? Revelio. 49 coins? I reckon I probably have enough to... Okay, so there's Hogwarts. Oh, wow, that's a cool view. I want to go back out and fight some more spiders, though. Where's that spider web? I'm just gonna go fuck with a few more spiders. Rebellion. And then go back to Hogwarts. Okay. Uh, okay, so that shows you. This is Eterus Potion. And this is Maxima Potion. That one I don't know how to make. Okay, so the cool thing about this, though, is. Um, it lets you know what you all have and what you all need. What is this now? A castle. Must have been quite stately in its time. Leaping toadstool caps. I think I've got enough of those. Where was that spider web? You know what? I don't think I want to run around out here too long. Although this is pretty cool. I am going to tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to travel back and get that recipe. Then I'll know what I'll need. We are going to go to Hogsmeade. Right back here. 
travel. Okay. <sighs> this is intense, guys. Oh, thanks for my... <laughs> what was that? Helpful hint to that it was like gone in like two seconds. Oh, it's right back up over here. Although I think there was. Rebellion. A... Wait, what was that? Is there a chest inside here? Welcome. Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Or is there a chest around outside the back of the building? Is that what that was? chest under the bridge. Why is it showing a yellow chest? Rebellio. Aha. Okay, guys. All right. Here here we go. Here we go. First time doing this, everybody. Oh, I did it. 500 coins? Oh, shit. Okay. To everybody who told me about that one, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Holy shnikes. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? All right, let's go back and get some stuff. Okay, where's his shop, though? Oh, what's this up here? Quidditch gloves. All right. Unidentified outfit item? Why is there so much random stuff all over the place? Or did I just steal it from that guy. Don't mind if I have some peanuts. Okay, let me get out of here. I gotta get... I have a little something to drink. Don't know what that was, or if it belonged to somebody, so that felt a little sketchy. But... Where was that? What's this over here now? Feels a little bit sketchy to be just taking random money, but you know what? Oh, is there another chest over here somewhere? this much stuff all over the place. <gasps> Is this one of the... Um... Incendium. No, that's... Oh, I gotta get away from this thing. Oh shit, another 500? Um... Lumos. Wow, there, you guys are not kidding. There is a lot of stuff over here. Incendio. Oh no, actually. And some people did say to, like, everybody's, I shouldn't say everybody, there's mixed messages I'm getting on whether to collect the field guide pages. And some people, no, I didn't want that. Um, some people are saying that you want them for the experience points. Rebellion. Some people are saying that they really don't do much. Well, wow, there's a lot of stuff to collect. Just like the... Uh, Oh, 
a lot of these are like the locks. Okay. Uh, I am going to go back and set another waypoint to J. Pippin's potions. Oh, but I know what I want to do. I want to check out those gloves that I got. Because I got new gloves. All right. Which gloves. Change appearance, because I like my legendary gloves. I want these gloves. No, I think I want my legendary gloves. Okay. In any regard, I've got some money now. We have got some money now, kids. Now I'm in a good, good mood. Hello there. All right. In the market for potions, are we? Sure I am. You got something to go on. All right, let's have what a can chat, I do for you today? my man. Maxima, you know what? We're gonna purchase this for now. A wise decision. Okay. Thank you. And I've still got a thousand ninety-four focus potion. I can just buy some, or I can brew some. Let's see what. Okay. Now let's do this. Let's sell some stuff first and foremost. Uh, do I want to sell a hat where my defense is up 33? Oh, that's not. Um, it's not accessible yet. Okay. I hope to see you again. No, nope, we're gonna talk. Now. What can I do for you today? Okay. No, I gotta back out here. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Okay. I need flux weed, flux weed stem and dug bug tongue. What can I do for you today? Okay, I'm gonna buy those. A wise decision. Thank you. Oh, where's flux weed stem? What? Bro doesn't have flux weak stem? Well, what the heck? I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. I need flux weak stem. What do I need? Okay, so I've got plenty for maxima potion and i need ashwinder eggs what can i do for you today so i've got oh, ashwinder eggs thank you <clears throat> i hope okay. to see you again farewell for now and mongrel fur i thought i bought five of those things okay Okay, um, flux weed stem he doesn't have. Okay, so I need to get focus potion. Just buy it flat out. What can I do for you today? Saying. A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Acquire and use focus potion. Okay, but do I need... Do I just need... Like, I don't want to just use the focus potion, like... To whatever, but... I guess I will. So, LB... 
¿no? the potion. Okay, so I see LB. RT. Okay, can I just not use the Focus portion. There. Incendio. Oh wow, you can really go at it with that, can't you? Holy shit. Okay. Player. Maxima and Eteris potions. Okay, so should I go back and just buy them? Or go to the Dark Arts Tower and brew them? You know what? I gotta, I gotta work on brewing potions. So I am gonna go and I am going to attempt to... Um... Secret rooms. Map chamber. Okay. Uh, hospital wing. Astronomy wing. Transfiguration courtyard. Astronomy tower. Charms classroom. Bell tower wing. Where is <coughs> charms? Greenhouses? Divination? Guys, why am I completely free? Potions. Jesus. Potions classroom. It says right there, potions classroom. Okay. So now we're going to go to the potions classroom because I need to brew some potions. Or was I just in the portions classroom? Okay, potions classroom. All right. So how do I actually brew potions? Potion station. All right, here we go. Wait a minute. So I can brew my own wiggle weld potion? <clears throat> this is the healing stuff? Come on. Guys. Are you kidding me? Okay, this is a complete and utter game changer. For those of you shaking your head at me right now, um, I ask for mercy. Okay, so Eteris Potion, I can do that. I don't know. It's interesting that it makes you wait, right? Like, 
kind of funny that it makes you wait. You'd think like you'd just click it and it would give it to you. I get there's the whole brewing process that kind of adds to the story, but it's interesting that you do have to actually wait. I had some Eteris Potion that I accidentally used before, did I not? Okay, and I need to brew some of this. Spell damage. Oh. Okay, I'm starting to put two and two together. So you, like when you're getting into a fight, you drink some of this, start blasting away, drink some more, start blasting away. All right, I think I'm starting to figure out what's going on here. Like, I can't just rely on just pressing buttons and fighting. Okay. Is leech juice used in anything else? Creates a storm. I mean, I guess I might as well... Might as well brew some of these while I'm here, right? It's only going to take a couple minutes. So, what should we talk about? Well, this is definitely a very educational episode, I guess you could say, because I am learning so much about brewing potions and how to use the potions and everything else. But again, if I do have to make like a little bit of a complaint, which my complaints for this game are almost none, it's that it actually makes you wait here for the brewing time. Um, I am going to brew two more, might as well. Um, so yeah, if you somehow randomly caught this as your first time watching me play this game, and you've made it this far in, um, a little bit of backstory, or if you um, um, scrubbed through and didn't hear the backstory, so when we probably a little uh, around a year after we started doing reactions um we put polls out as far as what we should all watch and um <clears throat> everyone had voted to do all eight harry potter movies so of course um we kind of committed to it um i was really critical and really or i was really skeptical when we started i thought they were all kids movies um, you know, I was in college and then past, you know, pretty much the time frame that they were coming out. So it wasn't really something that interested me. I was really critical of the first two movies. Thought they were, I, I mean, I gave them like high scores as far as value, but they weren't really for me because I thought they were kids movies. And what I always say is that like, as I went along, I learned that the Harry Potter movies weren't necessarily kids movies or the stories rather weren't kids stories. They were like this coming of age story that started when they were kids and the best like big pop culture comparison I could make was the movie Stand By Me which was an incredible movie if you haven't seen Stand By Me I cannot recommend it enough but it's a story about kids but it's not a kids movie it's a coming of age story and that's kind of what I learned about Harry Potter and got totally immersed we did all eight movies by the end you guys uh, who saw it know that I completely fell in love um, <clears throat> but absolutely loved him got into some audio books and we can talk more about uh, that a little later. Okay, so I have Wiggle Weld Potion, Eteris Potion, and Maxima Potion. And I have to acquire Maxima and Eteris Potions and use them simultaneously. So I'm going to look at the instructions and see if it has. It also like me to field test. I know I can find potions. My field guide will not guide me through this assignment, but my map could prove useful. Okay, so... Here is my question. I, you know what I'm gonna do? I am actually going to, um, I'm gonna go back out and do the sketchy area, world map. Um, I think this is about as far out, Jackdaw's tomb, um, as I could go. I can't go here yet. Um, I can definitely go here. You know what, we're going to go over by Jackdaw's tomb and see if I can't find some spiders to fight. 
or something like that because I'd rather actually use it. I know that focus thing I just kind of used in a random hallway. Those look like spider webs over there. Oh, so. nice to see you, my young friend. Oh, nice to see you too. Okay, so LB. Um, Maxima potion and Eteris potions. Acquire. Okay. And then LB uses them. Release LB to equip. Okay. Eteris. So it's Eteris. What's this? Ten coins. Okay. And then... Excellent. Okay, so I look like I'm made of rock. Okay, so a 10 potions class during the day. So I at least got a fair idea of how that works, which I think is pretty cool because I had no idea about any of that um, before at all. So that is actually, while I was a little frustrated earlier on when I got that quest, that I think is actually really handy because now I am going to be able to do a lot more... Um, a lot more damage. Um, I am going to be able to do a lot more damage during these fights, knowing that these potions, and then I can just go back to, um, just go back to the castle and make more. Um, no, not the great hall potions classroom. Okay, attend a potions class during the day. So, I should be right there. But in any regard, um, holding Y will follow up. Okay. Off on another adventure, are we? Something like that. But yeah, so some really valuable information. That's the one thing that I really like about this game is I feel like even if you weren't somebody who did a lot of gaming, this would be pretty easy to follow along. They give you a lot of helps and prompts and like that, like you're getting a lesson as part of, you're getting a lesson as part of like uh, your quest. So the quest teaches you how to kind of advance yourself in the game if that makes sense. It's not just a quest for the sake of a quest. <gasps> oh my god! Guys! Okay. Here it is. Okay, so where's the thing to turn it? Because everybody help me out with this one. Okay. Okay, so the spider is... One, hang on. One, two, <laughs> if you can see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. The spider is nine. One plus nine is ten plus three. One, two, three. That should be that dragon. No, 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 no. Oh, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Is there another one over here? No, that's it. I get that has to be right.
Or is it the... It's two question marks? Okay, so that one's a two question mark. Never mind. Okay. So, um... Okay, so the snake is one, two, three, four. So four plus 13 is 17 plus four. It's a snake. Four plus 13 is 17 plus four equals 21. So it is the snake. <laughs> So it's the snake. And is there another one over here? And that thing. And that thing, right? No! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, no, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Am I counting these wrong? No, there's ten of them. So one plus nine is ten plus three equals thirteen. That's got to be right. One, two, three, four, one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So the spider would be nine. So then I just need three. So the question mark would be th three. One plus nine equals ten plus three. Oh, come on. No way, I thought I had this figured out. Everyone gets assigned an order, one through 10, but everybody was seeing one through nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's 10 signs. And I thought it was just addition. Or is it backwards? Is it starting on the right? One, two, and that would be three, and then 10 would be the owl? Is the owl even an option? It is or that thing, whatever it is. And the bottom one would be um, well, if it's going in the same direction, it would be the snake would be one, two, three, four, five, six, six Seven plus thirteen. Okay, so the snake would be seven is thirteen, so one would be that thing. That would be that. Oh, come on. Seriously? I thought he had it. Unless I got one of these backwards. Thought it was just a math problem. One plus two is three plus ten. No. Oh. Three Fuck. Unless it goes backwards for one of them. Let's try it that way. Guys, this is killing me. I thought I read 
your help easy that this was just a math equation that these all had a value of one through ten. I'm gonna have to go back and read it again. This is driving me insane. I'm about to start breaking shit. <sighs> Unless that goes backwards, where. Where that's a uh, one, two, three, four. So four plus 13 is 17, and then seven would be. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, the lizard, and their opposite. The lizard's not even an option here, though, so. Fuck. I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna have to go back and, and read it again one more time. I'm not gonna bust out my phone right now, so. We'll come back, try it again. Ladies and gentlemen, I am hot right now, to say the least. I thought I had this figured out. Now I'm just, now I'm getting all turned around because I'm pissed off. God, I thought I could have sworn everybody said it like it was a values of one through nine, but I'm counting 10 symbols on the door. So it's like, I don't f fucking get it. Alright, well, you know what? I'm just gonna complete this quest, and then I'll have to, uh... We'll have to check back. I got way turned around anyhow, but that pisses me right off. I was going off memory, so maybe I should have wrote it down. I thought I had what everybody... Everybody said pretty figured out, and I thought I went to the right place in the castle. Apparently not. Revelio. I should be doing more Revelios. I just need to relax here. What's that right there? Oh, hey, look, another door. See? Eleven plus. I'm gonna try it on this door. Or just the. You know what? I'm just gonna go to class. We'll figure it out later. That's the last time I have a potion idea. We'll figure it out next time. You can advance time by accessing the map. And pressing R. Um, map. How do I know what time it is? Wait here to advance time from night to day or day to night, yes. How does Garrett's subterranean concoction. Oh, there we go. Too obtuse. Everyone's got their robes on, and I've got that I've got that dragon jacket. <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> just going. To, How are your assignments coming along? Just going to class in my dragon jacket. I completed your assignments, Professor. <laughs> Good. You should be ready to learn to pulse. <laughs> Let's see what you can do. Oh. Uh. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. What does the pulse so do? You've got it now. 
If you'd like to practice, and I think you should, perhaps best not to go flinging your... <laughs> ...about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Oh, they just kind of push them away, huh? new spell oh, what is my what is my next quest let's take a look flying class you know what I think I am going to go to flying class let's do this I need some like I'm not gonna lie guys I'm pretty pretty worked up over six talent points available uh, casting to pulse reduces an additional blast. Okay, to pulse looks pretty awesome. So when you guys help me out in the comments, when you guys get into a battle, do you do you go and like adjust your spells? Because I would imagine like depending on who you're fighting, you'd want. Um, depending on who you're fighting, you'd want to have like different spells lined up, you know, like spiders, like uh, Incendio, where it's like casts a bunch of flame. But if it's one person, like, I don't know that that would help. Gear appearance reward. Protectors ensemble. I gotta defeat 20 dark wizards. That's a pretty awesome ensemble, though. What did I get? Defeat. What did I get? Oh, complete dueling feats. Officer's uniform and officer's hat. I don't think I really love that, though. Okay. Talents, inventory, gear, um, outfit. Take this to the room of requirement. Where is the room of requirement? You know what? We'll check out the room of requirement next time. Maybe we'll start with that. But for right now, we are going to, I think we're going to end off today's, uh, today's gameplay with flying class like I said I need a little bit of levity given how frustrated I was um, I am gonna have to why that portrait was empty why not I am gonna have to write that down or look at it right before I play because I thought I had it figured out I thought everybody said it was one through nine but I'm seeing ten symbols on the wall and so Revelio. I'm uh, <sighs> I'm doing my absolute best to limit my curse words and I wouldn't really break anything. So this is the one thing that um, I've never been is I've never been a controller thrower. We had a buddy, Jeff, growing up, one of the guys that we played D&D &D with. Jeff was a controller thrower. Like if he got mad, he would toss his controllers. And whether it be controllers or cell phones or anything, like don't throw and break your own stuff. It's like the whole like punching holes in drywall stuff. It's like if you get upset, and I know some people, you know, respond physically or have different ways of handling their anger, but don't ever break your own stuff. It's like the worst lose-lose. So I'm not a controller thrower. I would never smack a table or throw my phone or throw something at your TV. You always see those videos like sports fans going nuts and punching their TV. Like, what does that accomplish when you're mad at a game? So, I just want everybody to realize that when I say, like, I'm going to break something, that is a complete and utter joke, because I would never break my own stuff. And now, all that being said, oh my god, guys. Flying class. Everybody grab a broom, and we shall get started. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm so excited. 
Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Okay. Yeah, Nimbus 3000 or Fireball? To remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Not a fan, I take it? <laughs> now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their I practice can't get over, over my the summer outfit. holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom. Say up firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. Now, your turn. Up! Up! Up, you stupid ratty school broom! <laughs> up! One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. Oh my god, guys, I'm so excited. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. You're like, I'm gonna press the Y button and skip this. Are you kidding? And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Good. Now. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Do take care. The brooms oh. are school property. I want them returned in one piece. Wish I had my own broom. Good grip. Ah, huh, I think I'm getting the hang of this. Oh, no, it's down, down, down. Excellent. This is going to take me a while to get used to. I'm so used to inverted controls. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise, shall we? I guess. We shall. This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for mm. more of a challenge. What a view. <laughs> oh, I got, I'm so Hello. used to going inverted. Nice. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I missed it. Son of a bitch. Oh, no, 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 Okay, I'm getting the hang of it now. to make an appearance once in a while <gasps> this is a little tricky because oh. <sighs> that wasn't too bad speed in direction is controlled with the left It's definitely tricky. <laughs> well done. At the moment. It's trickier than I thought it was gonna be. Oh, it's gonna take I a little bit. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clopton. Am I right in suspecting that a Gryffindor like you might be interested in a high-flying adventure? 
I like the sound of that. that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. You know, got to get in a little trouble once the in a while. The tour is about to begin. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Oh! The head of the gardens. The hot uh. of the windows just peek out. A bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? Oh no no! <laughs> this oh this is oh I am this inverted thing is gonna drive me nuts. Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Uh -oh. Now that's more like it. You sure you're now we're talking. Hippogriff? It's interesting because it's... Oh, this... There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the Owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? The inverted thing is going to take Flying me a while. tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tall Everett. This is definitely going to take me a little bit. Burst, hold flight speed, toggle flight speed, descend, descend, hold this one. Okay. And where have you two been? Oh, hello, Professor. Oops. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you oh. for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I'm disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Sorry about that business with Kagawa, but you have to admit those views were worth it. No regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spintwitch's in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Okay. All right. Well, you know what? I think that is a really, really good spot to save for today. 
Um, this was a lot of fun. So, okay. Well, so that was a ton of fun. Uh, a lot of fun going through that cave, although I got turned around quite a few times, but I guess that's part of it. Um, had a chance to practice some of the stuff that you guys showed me as far as, <clears throat> um, you know, as far as opening the chests with the eye, as far as, you know, certain things with casting spells, didn't get the, uh, the door <laughs> with the combinations. But I will. I will next time. I'll pay closer attention. I thought everybody said it was the nine circles. So I had some good practice um, using the spells. Um, I got to travel a little bit without actually looking for a flu powder um, spot. So a lot of the things that you guys had given me advice on in the previous one, I was able to take it. But this was so much fun. It really was. Going through, uh, again, the K was very visual. Got some battles against the spiders, a mongrel, which I still feel guilty because it just looked like a wolf which I would never want to hurt not that I really want to hurt spiders either but in any regard you get my point but got to battle a couple of dark wizards got to get myself some new outfits and of course got a chance to um, use potions brewed my first potions first flight on a broom so a lot going on for this episode but as always wanted to thank you guys so much for joining along I'm just having so much fun on this journey um, for those of you asking about lives and more group play with the other guys, those are going to be coming soon. And I hope in one of the next few upcoming parts, I am going to sit down and do an actual live. So really looking forward to that. Um, as I've said previously, um, this gaming channel is really in its infancy. And so we've got a lot of learning to do, a lot of leaning on everybody as far as finding out what you guys want to see and more. So <clears throat> make sure you check out uh, Answers Mortal Kombat videos. We have other stuff coming with the group coming soon for you guys. So once again, for the Appleton Oak, everybody at Bad, Mad, <laughs> Bad Madison, thank you for stopping by, and we'll see you on the next edition of Hogwarts Legacy.